Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel today and today we've got episode 27 of my Creating Chelsea series. So before we do get in the video, if you drop a like that would be incredible, because smash maybe 40 likes as it is weekday, that would be awesome, subscribe if you wanted to the channel. We are very close to 1.8k subs as well, so if you guys could subscribe, that would be hugely, hugely appreciated. Get into the video, it was like last week I think when the, foot, um, the 7 years was out and they gave us 3 packs. And I was opening some of them just off camera, just randomly, and I pulled an Oscar. Obviously, it's untradeable, so this is the one that I've bought previously. But this one, obviously, I've got, it goes about 3k, 3.5k. He has all the stats, he has the 25 games played, 17 goals, 19 assists. This one, I could sell, have a little bit of money, only 3k more. But I've got one, obviously, in my club, the uh, one I got untradeable, so obviously he won't be there. He'll be, like, right at the end, as you can see here. There's an untradeable one here. Uh, a first owner. I don't know if I'm going to use this one. The Oscar that I did buy, like, however however long ago, it was quite a long time ago. I did buy him, and he's got all the stats in him. So I think I might, you know, either I'm not going, I'm not too sure yet. I might not play Oscar for this whole this whole episode. And then you guys tell me below in the comments if you want me to use him or not. If you want me untradeable or not. Comment down below. Either comment down below. Keep Oscar untradeable or keep the one with all the stats on, the one that I've bought previously. Because I really want to know. I don't want to sell him. I quick sell him or not. So please tell me down below and I'll get, let's, let's get straight into the video. So I normally do quite a lot of trading at the beginning, but this time I'll leave it for the bit and I might do a bit in the, uh, in the middle of both of my games. So as you can see, this is not the team I'm going to be using. What am I doing? So this is the team that we are using for our first game of the episode. I know I just said I'm not going to use Oscar, but he is like our best centre attacking mid. Probably one of our only attacking mids as well. We've got Costa back in. The whole front line is completely different. William, Costa and Pedro. Fabregas is coming to the team with Mikel, as Piliqueta, Courtois stays in there after a very good performance. So let's get into the game, let's get a win and start the episode on a high. So we are starting in Division 3, as you can see, no games currently, so hopefully we can get off to a good start in Division 3. Hopefully get the win in Division 3 and hopefully get two wins in Division 3, secure 6 points and try and not get the relegation. So this guy actually has a guest as well with him, so I don't know, it could make it maybe a bit harder or a bit easier, I'm not too sure. But he's got a hybrid there. Hasn't, not everyone's on full cam, he's got Müller up front with Lewandowski, Gotza, he's got Sterling who's not actually on full cam, as well as William who's not on full cam, but the rest of the team is quite solid, let's get into the game, hopefully we can get the win. Gary Cahill versus Thomas Müller, come on mate, no we do not want to concede this uh, early on, uh, we said we don't want to concede early on and what have we just done, we've just conceded lads, um, yeah let's just, you know, forget that guy up and it's still 0-0 guys, come on, in our heads it's still 0-0. Let's go and get the win, because that was a terrible start. Uh, no, 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 no. Um, I actually have nothing to say for myself there. That was completely my fault. I literally just might as well have scored nine goal for him. That, okay, what? honestly, today is not my day for FIFA. I'm honestly playing so, so bad, and I don't know how he's getting through every single time. Diego, please, Diego. Yes, Diego Costa has scored an absolute bang of a shot. We're back in this game. 2-1 down. But we can do this, lads. If we believe the Chelsea boys can come back and we can win this. Oh, he's got his tactics ready. But Gary Cahill's out to stop them. And he plays it a free ball to Diego Costa. Diego Costa versus Fernandinho. Surely he's got the strength in him. He's got the strength in him. And he can sweaty it to Willian. Oh, my God, he's hit the crossbar. Oh, my God. This is unbelievable. This is at how I not scored that. I should be back in the game well and truly. 2-2. That is ridiculous. And he's headed that in. Oh my god. He's not headed that in either. That is unbelievable stuff, lads. Oh my god. Oh my god. I was not even commentating over that because that shouldn't have went in. That that should not have went in. What just happened there? Okay, to Costa again. Costa, please finish it this time. Yes! Costa has finished it. Costa's played very well today. 2 3 or 3 2, however you want to say it. But we're back in the game again. If he gets another goal, I think it is gone. Oscar's done. He's done well. He's done well. Give it to Mikel. Mikel can cut back. Give it in to Diego. Oh, somebody shoot. It's gone in. It's actually gone in. Diego Costa has got his hat trick. Unbelievable scenes here, lads. 14 minutes left on the clock. Can someone get the winner? Hopefully it's me. But Costa, mate, you've proved yourself well today. And the game has ended. It is finished. 3 all. Such an intense game, guys. Such an intense game. But we've gone away with the draw. I'll take the draw, to be fair. Division 3 is getting much harder. But the draw was well-deserved. And as you can see, actually, Costa, he only got two goals. 
counted as an own goal for Diego Alves, which is very unlucky because he didn't deserve the hat trick there. He played incredible. 466 coins. As you can see, the stats are very even. The same amount of shots. Uh, he had one more shot on target. I'd better possession. It was a very close game. So whoever won that would have been very unlucky. So guys, we've done a little bit of trading. It's not honestly the most of trading. I've been struggling quite a lot lately to do a bit of trading. Obviously, that Oscar's just there because I don't know what to do with him. So comment down below if you haven't already. And uh, you've got two non-rare guys here. 250 coins for King and 200 coins for Smith. Actually, Smith I've got for 200 coins. I can sell him for around, I don't know, about three. Okay, he's gone down a bit. I'll probably put him up for about 400. And I'll put him up for, how long? I'll put him up for six hours. Hopefully, he will sell. And then Andy King here with 250 coins. I think it goes for around 400, 500 coins. As you see here, the cheapest at the moment is 650 coins. So I'll put him up for 550. Hopefully, he does go and sell. But guys, this is the team that we are using for the second game of the episode. It's basically the same side, except for my bought in Ramirez and I've bought in John Terry instead of Gary Cahill and John Obi Mikel. So let's get into the game. Let's hopefully get a win this time. The last game was very good, very intense. But this game, hopefully, we can get the win and, you know, get a few points on the board. So this guy's team is. Um, uh, I don't know what to say about this team, actually. It is a very random team. Literally, he's got so many dead links. There's only two links in the whole team. And that's between Varane and Navas and then Contral and David Luiz. He's got a few good players in there. He's got Remy in there, Conor Priyanka's in there. But the chemistry is all over the place. 54 chemistry. Hopefully we can get the win. Because his side, um, it's, it's a bit different, isn't it? I'm not going to lie. I've never seen one of them like that before. Ivanovic has come out of nowhere and he has not got the ball. So we need to defend this really well. Kurt Zuma. Oh my god. He has not just done that to me. Kurt Zuma was like pressuring, pressuring him out. Using his strength against Remy, and um, he has just scored an absolute worldy of a goal. Honestly, I don't know how he's done that. Remy's on like literally about four chem, but he's absolutely scored a banger against me. And um, well, I've got to come back from this now, don't I? Again, one nil down again. Hopefully, we don't get two down, otherwise, that would just be a nightmare start as well. Oscar's gonna go alone here. He's going through the middle, and he's still going. And he's still going. He can play it to Costa. Costa has scored that. Look at that, he's done incredible this whole episode really, 1-0, and it's very laggy this game, so hopefully they do not quit. What a ball from Fabregas, he can bang one Oscar, we know he can bang him, one goal for Oscar, it's his first goal for his new card, Ramirez to Fabregas, Fabregas back to Ramirez, and Ramirez, he's hit the post, but it doesn't matter because Fabregas has done well, and he's got the rebound, and we're winning 3-1. Oscar's going to whip it out to the edge. Fabregas has a first touch, a not very good one, but he's going to bang it anyway, and it is an absolute screamer for one up, just before half time as well, what a great time to score, but we're looking very comfortable, Fabregas with his second goal of the game, can he get his first hat-trick of this whole series? A great ball, and it is a great finish, who's that, I think that's Ramirez with the goal, he's been very quiet this game, but he has got himself on the score sheet. Well played to Diego. Diego's going to finish it off 6-1. This is honestly just getting about now. Can we get maybe 7 or maybe even 8 goals here? Fabregas has still not got his hat-trick yet. I want him to get his hat-trick, so you can go yourself, mate. Let's bang it, Fabregas. He has got his hat-trick. 7-1. Seth Fabregas was his first hat-trick of the whole series. And he's deserved it. He's played incredible. You know, since I've got him, really, he's just played unbelievable. And there you go, guys. The game has ended. And I feel sorry for the guy, really. We've absolutely bashed him. 7-1. Fabregas with the match ball. Very well done, Fabregas. Fully deserved the win. This guy, honestly, has just been violated. So as you see, from two games, possible six points. We've got four. So we've only dropped two points. It's not the best. But we have truly, after the first match, we've redeemed ourselves with a 7-1 win. And, uh... We can definitely go on to win the title in this division. And the two guys haven't sold yet, but I'm sure they will. I'll do a bit more trading. So, guys, I hope you have enjoyed the video. If you have, drop a like. That would be incredible. You can smash 40 likes on the video. That would be insane. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. And it's been Bomb Legend. Please like, subscribe, and see ya.